All right, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily Call of Duty content. But first, I got to give a call out to each and every one of my gym stars. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ, coming to you live with another video, man. Check it out, boy. I'm getting these free, ooh, these twists. Them things coming along, but I was on the court yesterday and they were just shaking. I said, hey, we almost there, man. Once I get long enough with these little twists, then I'm gonna go with the dress, man. Y'all might not have known if you haven't been watching. Y'all probably been watching my Call of Duty videos. Y'all been waiting for these, man. Waiting for um these to come back so you don't know what my hair situation. A lot of a lot of y'all, the last time y'all saw me, I was bald headed. I had a straight bald head. Like I used to go in there every day, every couple of days, and just bald head it off. But we ain't there no more, man. Right now, we back at it like a snack at it. Call of Duty, man. Yo, yeah, damn it, yo. Yeah. So should I say, uh, look, man, check it out. I call this video a safe space, or this is how I feel about your safe space. Because when I played this game of Call of Duty, this is one of the games, this is Modern Warfare 2, just in case y'all were wondering. Um, this is, I, 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 when I started playing this game, man, let's, let's just get right into it now. Look, I'm, I'm gonna talk about it while we in the lobby, but when I started, this is a game, when I started playing, there was really no such thing as a safe space. You know, like, this is what, this is what everybody's talking about. You gotta learn how to play the game. You gotta learn how to adapt. You gotta learn how to get your safe space and all of this stuff, man. Find your safe space and stuff like that. This is how I feel about your safe space right here. What happened to the days where being good at the game didn't didn't involve any gimmicks? The last video y'all saw, I probably threw that right there. I didn't throw it the right way. I haven't been on the game a long while, but I know people come up this here. But look at this, jump over there. Ooh, double dutch out this motherfucker. Get dropped, bitch. But look, why, look, yeah, I'm, I'm in my safe space. Look, I know you on the wall. Tell that bad boy on the wall that I get from wrong. What, what are you doing? You go, so y'all gonna try, try your luck. I just dropped two of your homeboys and yo, yo, three piece, two piece, uh, three piece. Uh. Look, I just dropped two of your homeboys. So the thing that you think the most rational move to make right now is to just come back at me and, and try to try to do to just drop two of your homeboys. I don't know, man. Look, they got their safe space over there. I know I cannot infiltrate the safe space until I get rid of this dude. He's trying to look down there for me. It don't matter. Last game I played against these guys right here. But look at everybody just huddled up in the corner. Why you gonna try to come back at me? You can't do it, man. Look at that two-piece. Huh? I got my Harriers already. Harriers, come out and play. Look, there's so many people out here trying to get to the safe space. I don't even get to... I don't even get to really do nothing. Woo! Look at, look at, look at it. Harry, look, already eight, uh, what is it, 30 seconds into the game. Oh, oh, it's prime time. Let's get this here started. PP7 number six, gotta be extra small and the most overpowered secondary in the game, the M93. Rafaka. Y'all already know what that is, man. Woo! -hoo! And the second most overpowered. You can't do that. Hip fire. You get caught up in it. Hip fire. Hip fire. I got everything, man. Listen. In a game like this, you can have your safe space. And the reason that I did two kill UAVs is because I played these guys. I played like four games. I done dropped 30 kills like four times in a row. But the thing was, I played these guys the game before on sub base. Sub base is probably one of the only game, only maps on this game that, that comes to mind right off the bat. Where you can hold down certain areas and you can you can just not let people get in and all that. You can have your safe space and you can do all that. And look at Jolene. I bet when we look at make make sure when we get back we look at Jolene's score and see that I bet you he's at the bottom because the trashiest person always has it. But look, look, your safe space don't mean nothing. The game before this, I played these guys and um you know I I I, I, I wasn't lobby hopping or nothing, but I was just like yo, let me just see if I can find me somewhere to go. I hopped in, we started playing. These guys immediately had had two skill two kill spy planes and three kill um UAV blockers and I'm like woo look at that M93 Rafa and then I got shot by his homeboy over there they had three kill plane uh, spy plane blockers and then two kill spy plane I'm like bro I'm not finna deal with this so I guarantee you I can get the two kills before anybody else in the game because I'm a rusher so this is what happened this was that and look at him hiding in his safe space in the house but I got something for you like I said man have your safe space hide in your space safe space do all of that but you shouldn't be able to do look at that Jolene destroy the chopper helicopter helicopter again uh this game Bro, you talk about poor visibility? This game right here, my guy, it most definitely had poor visibility of, of players, and that didn't stop us. So we looked at the poor visibility and all that good stuff, man. Look, look at this dude right here. You're trash! Payback's a bitch, so your name is Payback, isn't it? Look, 
you trash. If you bad at this game, if you're bad at shooting, bad at all that, this game don't have the automatic lock on, snap on, aim, and all that stuff that, that Modern Warfare actually has. It's so much stuff. It ain't even just the fact that it's poor player visibility camping and all of that good stuff, man. Like, like I said, I can adjust, I done adjusted. I look, you can look at my last two gameplays on this channel. I dropped two 30 pieces. So, I mean, I've obviously adjusted. The, it's just like Murder So said. We've been doing this. We've been whooping people's ass. Like, we ain't sitting there here like like they just need to do something for me or you. And I miss that dude behind the fence. He got me. They, like, we've been doing this. I can go back to any Call of Duty and drop 30 right now. Like, like I'm Mike suiting it back up, with like, like, like I'm putting on the number 45. I can go back to any card and drop 30 right now. And it won't make nothing because it just is what it is. But look, look, you don't have to get better at the game. I don't like these new games, how they putting them out. You don't have to get better at the game, get better at the game mechanics, get better at doing what you're supposed to do. You just got to get better at being a bitch. Nobody don't want to do that, because like we said, if nobody moves, my guy, then what's going to happen? If nobody in the whole game moves, then we're just going to be stuck. Now, so look, in, in Modern Warfare, you can't outshoot a camper because it got the snap-on aim. You can't beat a camper because there's too many lines of sight, too. I, man, I used to be able to jump in their window. You can tell how bad I've gotten at this game, and I still came on here and dropped 30 on these trash bag kids, man. Like... Look, I'm looking for this dude right here. He's looking for him. I'm like, well, go on out there. And then he, he went ahead and extinguished him. Sell on extortion now. Precord me now. I throw spit at each Look at this. He blocking the UAV as if I use it anyway. Like, this is all they were doing last game. Two kill spy planes and blocking the UAV. That just mean I got to be a little bit more careful. Hip fire. You get caught up in it. Hip fire. Hip fire. It don't matter what you do, man. Like I said, but look, the whole point of the whole video is this. I don't think we should be coddling people and trying to help them find a safe space. You're not going to get better at something by not doing it. Hence, you won't get better at playing basketball if you don't play against good competition. You're not going to get better at something by not doing it. And we got all the parents out here, ah, ah, I don't want my kid to feel inferior. It's just like I put up that, uh, that video of Kendrick Perkins' kid whooping ass in basketball at eight. He's head and shoulders above the rest, right? And I bet you anything they're going to try to put him in another league or something because he's too good or he's just he's just way better than the kids, the other kids, and he didn't really want to make them feel bad. In life, nobody don't care if you feel bad. If you trash, you trash. That's just how it is. We don't need to be coddling people, letting them know that somebody, that's what's wrong with the world right now. You got so many people out there thinking that somebody going to do something for them. Ain't nobody going to do nothing for you. Get better, bitch. Look at this. He walking around there. Just like, I don't even know where that dude came from. Just get better, bitch. That's all you got to do, man. Stop being a bitch. Stop thinking that somebody going to do something for you, man. And doggone just get busy and get out there and get it did. Private pancakes? Y'all probably don't even know what that is. But y'all know what I'm trying to say, man. Like I said, they, they make this safe space for you. That's what they said they wanted to do. They wanted you to be able to not come in here and run up against a raging lunatic that don't do nothing but run and sprint around the map and don't give a damn about this stuff. Yes, you could camp in this game, but guess what? If Jay-Z fades back for her ain't. No good. Yes, you could camp in this thing, but this is what's going to happen to you. Get body, bitch. I'm Bobby, bitch. You could camp in these games, man, but guess what? And look, look, where Joel at? Where Joel at? Look at Joel Lynn, 15 and 11. He the only one that went positive. Hey, I, I stand corrected. He went positive, but the rest of your team, like, bro, this is what the scoreboard is supposed to look like when you got a lobby full of campers and you got a superior rushing machine like me, like the most MLG athlete that I, like eight thoughts be saying, man. Look, this is what's supposed to happen. I'm supposed to be able to overcome their camping by being better than they are because most people are camping because they can't play the game. If you camping because you can't play, why should you be rewarded for camping? It doesn't make sense. But hey, like I said, they're going to say, they, they're like Murder Show said, they're going to be like, hey, 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 you just need to get good, man. Just get good. Brother, I've been doing this. I've been doing this. I just don't want to adapt. But y'all saw the last two games. I put up a 29-piece in Hardcore Team Deathmatch and a 30-piece on the other one. This ain't nothing, man, but they need to do something, man. Look, I don't even care about the poor player, poor, poor player visibility. Let's get the doors, blow all the doors off the hinges, make more maps where people can't just hide. 
Maybe the game that I'm playing here is, is just, it's an old antiquated way of playing the game, rushing and running around and stuff like that, bro. But I don't think so. I think we'll have a lot more fun if, if everybody play it like me because, uh, well, you don't have to play like me, but y'all understand what I'm trying to say, man. We don't want a game where people camping beats people who actually move around the map. Because if it wasn't for people that move around the map, who would the campers have to shoot, right? I bet you anything the campers ain't having no fun in, mo in, in modern warfare. And if they are, it is what it is. But just like Murder Show say, bro, I just camp my area. I'm a camper area, and I'm gonna keep coming back and forth and back and forth, and I'll be the master of my domain, like Seinfeld said. And, uh, you know, and when it comes to winning, <clears> hmm. <throat> You gonna stop short. That is it, what it is. Anyway, man, I gotta get up out of here, man. Hope y'all enjoyed the video. Hope y'all understand what I'm trying to say, man. We don't want a game where people are rewarded for sitting still. If I go and venture out, the people that leave their parents' house and venture out and go out into the world, we reward it. Not the people that just sit in one spot and don't never do nothing at all, bro. Come on, man. Come on, man. Come on, man. I mean, unless you're paying all the bills that your parents have. A lot of people staying at home and helping out because you know. But if, if, you, if you ain't doing that, then you shouldn't be rewarded. That boy, shit. Then you still ventured out and went and got a job and did that. The people that sitting still should not be rewarded over the people that venture out. That's all I'm saying, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comments, man. I have adapted. I just don't want to. It is what it is, man. I'm going to y'all next time. Till next time. It's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ. Godspeed!